morning guys cheetah decided to photo bomb my good morning clip apparently the minute i pulled the camera out she put her head in my lap <laughs> yes you did yes you did i know um i had a pretty late start to the morning um i woke up late because i was pretty tired after um getting up early yesterday and then just a very fun filled afternoon but um when you're you know kind of running on adrenaline with all that then the next day you're tired so um <clears throat> today is just being taken as a rest day I was planning on going for a run and I may still do it tonight but I, I stepped outside to take Cheetah to potty and it is way too hot to um to run right now but it's also 80 degrees um because it's the middle of the afternoon so it makes sense so for now, we are just enjoying the day by lounging on the couch. Um, I hope to get some work done on Saving Falcon later on today. Um, I I need to work on Chapter 4. Um, but it's just so, sometimes I, I kind of have to be in the mood for editing. And I'm trying to set myself a deadline of when I want to get it done. Because that's how I managed to write the novel in the first place, was I set myself a deadline to get it done. But, um... <laughs> So I definitely want to have it done by the end of April, um, but I plan to do a little bit of work on it later this evening. <coughs> Did I wake you up? <coughs> You're so cute. I gotta say, as much as I'm looking forward to um, seeing Panda and Princess and Yachty again next week, I'm gonna miss this girl. Yeah, I'm gonna miss this girl. Um, so. Yeah, for now, it is just a relaxing day on the couch, and, um, I don't know what else to say, because <laughs> that's, that's what it is, it's a relaxing day on the couch, so, hope you guys are having a good day, whatever it looks like, and I will see you guys in a little while. Hey guys, so, after about an hour and a half, <clears throat> I got really tired of sitting on this couch, um, so I decided to get up and clean. And I did the dishes, and when I was almost done with the dishes, I just started not feeling very good. Just tired, weak, just one of those days. Um, so, now I'm back on the couch. I, I did do the dishes. I finished the dishes, so I'm taking that as a victory. Um, but I will still want to vacuum, take out the trash, dust. Um, but for now, I'm on the couch. And that is the reality of CF and chronic illness. I've been, I would say for a while, I've been on a pretty good health streak, um, been able to basically do what I want and, um, haven't really been bothered by Sia, um, <clears throat> but then there's days like today that reminds you that, hey, you do have a chronic illness, um, even though you haven't felt it in a while, I'm still here, um, so when I'm on, when I'm in a period of where my health isn't the greatest and I'm having these bad days often, I will typically just push through them and do what I want to do anyway. But when I'm on a streak of good health, like I am thankfully am right now, and I have these days where I don't feel very good, I don't have a lot of energy, I try and listen to my body. I try to balance it out between doing what I want to do and not being stuck on the couch all day and also listening to my body that's obviously saying, hey, today we just need to lay low. And I would say it's, it's frustrating, especially, you know, I have a week and a half left um, in Florida and I want to soak up as much time and do as much as I can within this next week and a half. <clears throat> and it's like, I want to, you want to say, well, I'm just going to do it anyway and then enjoy my time and then I'll just let myself crash when I get home. But the reality is if I push through today, tomorrow is just going to be worse and I could rest today and tomorrow could be worse but I'm doing what I can to make it not end up like that so part of enjoying my time in Florida and um sorry my camera cut off um is taking the time to take the time to rest and um so that's what I'm going to do today and it's not that I can't say that I'm perfectly happy that I'm stuck on the couch today but I can't say that I'm, you know, sad either. You know, I make the most of what I got to work with on that particular day. So I'm going to rest, probably read a book, watch YouTube. I haven't decided yet. 
Um, and then hopefully in a couple of hours or an hour or so, I'll feel better and be able to finish the clear cleaning that I wanted to get done. Hey guys, so I actually ended up falling asleep. Um, I didn't mean to, but I was just lying on the couch and I ended up falling asleep. And thankfully I feel much better now. Um, so I'm going to probably eat something and then uh, maybe get the rest of the cleaning done. I guess maybe I just needed more sleep. I don't know, I didn't wake up early this morning, but <laughs> thankful to be feeling better. That's all that really matters. Hey guys, so I'm feeling much better than I was um, this afternoon. I seem to have rebounded from whatever was making me so tired. So I'm gonna take advantage of the evening because I really haven't been outside all day um, and take Cheetah for a little run because uh, it's cooled down now the sun's kind of behind the clouds a little, um, behind the clouds, behind the um, horizon a little bit. So we're gonna go for a run. It'll probably be an easy run, like half a mile or so. Um, but I kind of had some energy and I wanted to use it while I got it. So I'm gonna go for a run with her and um, take advantage of the evening. Hey guys, so we ended up doing a quarter mile in three minutes. So not a far distance, but a pretty moderate tempo. Um, and now I'm just gonna walk out, walk it out with her, tell my breathing and my heart rate go back to normal. And um, then I'm gonna head in and do my treatment and kind of wind down for the night. So while I'm out here, I'm gonna say thanks so much for coming along on my day today and I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night.